In this video, I will explain how to make a chart sing by applying the data to ink ratio to this chart. To paraphrase the Pirates of the Caribbean, a busy chart tells no tale. But first, we need to understand what the data to ink ratio is. It is the ratio of all the ink used in the visualization in relationship to the ink used specifically to show the data. The aim is to reduce the amount of non-essential ink. The theoretical ideal is 1.0, but anything above 0.75 is already efficient. Let's look at an example to illustrate this. This chart scores low on this ratio, and as a result, it is hard to understand what I need to care about and what action I should take. Let's reduce the non-essential ink and start with removing the main background. As we proceed, note that we're not removing ink that displays the data. Now remove the second background. Remove the chart border, remove the shadows on the labels, and the shadows under the bars. Drop the redundant labels on the right. Now move the unit of measure into the chart title and remove the redundant labels. Simplify the x-axis values and orient horizontally. And now something magical happens. By removing non-essential ink, we now have the ability to direct someone's attention. The data story becomes clearer and we know what to focus on. But we are not done yet. Let's lighten the labels and the title and chart lines. A big step is to directly label the bars and the values on the bars so we don't have to reference the axes, which also allows us to remove the scale and the axes lines. Now, finally, we reduce the font size, resulting in a chart with a high data to ink ratio. And we're still able to direct people's attention tell a good story with less amount of ink. Now, what a difference in the before and after. We started with a low data to ink ratio and ended up maximizing the data to ink ratio. However, this does not mean we always want to maximize the data to ink ratio. So use with caution and find a good balance that makes sense for your organization, for your charts, and the way you want to present your message. My name is Nicholas Kelly with Delivering Data Analytics. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, you can follow me for more tips and tricks related to dashboards, data visualization, and data storytelling. And until next time, I'll calculate later.